Um, it, was, it was great. It was great. Uh, you know, a lot of predictable things. Like, it was hard, and the fans were, were loud, and the, the scene is just, you know, idyllic. So. I uh, saw you attacking pretty early on. Was that your strategy today, to go early and go hard? Um, you know, uh, it, you just can't fake it on this course. So, yeah, it was, uh, it was my... I, I, I realized, like, i got to make it hard early. Otherwise, uh, um, I'm not going to have an advantage at the end. So. Yeah. And you only had one team out there, uh, Mike Sayers. But did, that, did that play a role in, in your strategy? Um, very much so. I mean, he made sure that nothing... Uh, Nothing cheap went early, you know. I've got to because if you get a if you get 45 seconds on this course, I don't care who you are, uh, it's it's going to be hard. It's going to be hard to bring that back. And um, so Mike made sure a few attacks didn't get very far and um, kept him dangling out there and rode a stiff tempo that strung it out. And uh, it was he was he was crucial for the first half of the race for sure. And when you got away with Justin England, what did you think? Did you think that that, that was it? Were you pretty sure that that was going to stay away? Um, you know, when I when we when we were maintaining 20 second gap. Um, I was getting pretty confident because uh, we were still holding back on the climbs a little bit and uh, we fell into a good rhythm and uh, you know maybe you know guys were going hard uh, you know they could ch you know, chip off a few seconds each lap but we'd be able to gauge it and if we saw within 20 seconds if you saw them taking off five seconds you we could we could you know the next few laps like you know tighten down the screws and keep the gap so uh, so uh, yeah, once we had 20 seconds, I was pretty confident we could we could make it work. And uh, what happened in the closing laps when Justin went? Did you just not have a response? For that? Uh, just... Yeah, I don't I don't want to you know I got a list of excuses, but um, <laughs> but he he rode a great race and he was he was strong and uh, we we said hey let's let's go till three laps to go and we went through three laps to go and uh, he tacked me after the second uh, left hander and um, held the gap so it was a great race for Justin. And finally, how do you think your training around Sonoma County prepared you for this race? Oh, you know, uh, I'm not going to tell you too many secrets, but it, it's good. It's good. Yeah, Sonoma County is the place to be, you know. Uh, I mean, you can't, you can't go out your door without facing hills like this, so it's nice. Cool, man.